I'm going to show you a tactical advantage when you're going to use the open URL or file on success option for an action. I'm going to show you the difference between targeting a new window and leaving the defaults. This click box right here, I've set the on success to open URL or file. I'm targeting a website called Super Simplistic Solutions. I'm going to preview the project in a web browser just to see what it does by default. Now, when the lesson opens up, I'm going to fast forward to the end of the lesson just to save a little bit of time here. So I'll use the play bar here and just kind of go forward to the end of the lesson. And here is the click box on top of a website. I'm going to go ahead and click it. And as expected, the Super Simplistic Solutions website appears. However, the learner is likely going to lose contact with the lesson. Certainly, the learner can click the back button to go back to the lesson. And there it is. Let me fast forward again. What I typically see happening, however, after the learner clicks the link, they close the browser window, and there goes the lesson. As an alternative, there's a little drop-down menu to the right of URL that is often overlooked by Captivate developers. You click that drop-down menu, and you choose New from the available options. It's as simple as that. If I go to the File menu and choose Preview in Web Browser again, check out the difference. Once again, I'm going to fast forward to the end of the lesson just to save a little bit of time. Just use this forward button a couple of times here. I'm going to click the same click box. It's going to take me to the same Super Simplistic Solutions website. In this instance, I'm using Google Chrome opens up in a new tab. Learner closes the tab. The lesson is still available for the learners to interact with.